heart of every vehicle is the powertrain. And what we have is our all new LF4 36 twin turbo. And this engine here is not the LF3 that we have in the CTS V Sport that some uh, may have asked. This one is uh, designed to rev up extremely quickly and be very responsive. And it puts out 464 horsepower at 5,800 uh, RPM. And it also puts out 445 pound feet of torque, all the way from uh, 3,000 RPM, 3,400 up to uh, well over 5,000. And it's extremely quick and responsive. And the, the reason for it being so responsive is we went ahead and reduced the mass of all the rotating inertia components. So it's got titanium connecting rods. It's got aluminide titanium rotors in each one of the turbos so they can spin up very quickly. We have sodium filled exhaust valve, hollow exhaust valves that allow them to actuate very quickly. In, in addition, we've got a very short runner system between the turbos and the throttle body. And it's roughly 12 inches, roughly 25 to 30 percent shorter than a conventional turbo. And what that does is with that shorter path, it means that we can compress the air and push it into the throttle that much faster. And air is a spring, and the shorter that spring, the less compression, the less variation, the faster response. And you're going to get a chance to appreciate this uh, today and see what it can do out here on the track. But uh, I uh, encourage you to try it in the different modes. Uh, the guy's going to start you out in tour, take it up to sport and, uh, and track, and you're going to get a chance to hear how it uh, has its own unique sound signature out there. And uh, it's very rewarding. As we move down, uh, behind the engine, we have our new GM 8-speed transmission that will be in the other Cadillac rear-wheel drive cars also this year for 2016. ATS all the way through CTS and CT6. But this is the high torque variant, the 8L90. It's actually 12 and a half kilos lighter than the six speed that it replaces. It has a 30% reduction in uh, spin loss, and so it's more efficient, uh, driving greater fuel efficiency. And it has response times for the manual shifts that are on par with the DCT yet it's got the refinement of an automatic. So every day it's sophisticated, it's refined, and it's fast. And I encourage you to, uh, to try that. Also, want to use our performance algorithm shift. When you put the car in the track mode, it will do all the shifting for you. It will hold those downshifts as you are exiting the turn so it doesn't upshift in a turn and, and upset the car. It will, uh, as it senses you're coming into the corner, it will downshift, give you that automatic downshift, get your throttle in the right position, and let you power through the corner so you can do it most effectively. Let's walk on down to uh, some of the magic in how we get the torque to the ground. This is our electronic limited slip rear differential. And in this differential, there are two uh, basic chambers of hydraulic fluid. We have one that has standard diff fluid that basically uh, lubricates the, uh, the pinion. We have our own hydraulic circuit that is a clutch-driven device that basically, and its own unique controller, that allows us to control the torque and we no longer have to deal with a fixed bias ratio um, rear differential. We can vary that torque and we can get the right torque to the right wheel so that as you're going through a corner, we can keep the torque very high on the inside wheel, normally which is being lifted off uh, during the corner. We can add stability during quick lane change maneuvers. We can get you to exit out of that turn much faster as a result of the electronic limited slip. And even though you don't know what's happening out there, it's making you a better driver which each, with each and every maneuver that you have out there on the road. And it, uh, it's incredible in what it can do. And this is on the CTS V Sport and it's on our V Series. And we're very proud of the performance that uh, it delivers. And then last to the right, we have our Recaro seats. These are an option that are available on the uh, ATS and CTSV this year. That we designed these with Recaro, extremely comfortable yet very supportive. These are 16-way seats that have pneumatic bladders for both bolster, lumbar, and uh, seat back, and uh, will keep you planted. They're trimmed in uh, Microsoft uh, Microsoft uh, fiber here as well as on the back. When you're in the back of the car, you know you're in a Cadillac, regardless of what seat you're in. And uh, extremely uh, well done and very comfortable.